Hey guys, Sprague here. Welcome to the first episode of my TSM for Noobs series. The goal of this series is to give you a basic understanding of Trade Skill Master 3, the add-on, and some of its main features, how to set it up, and how to get using it for the very first time. TSM is pretty complicated to set up, especially if you haven't seen a guide or anything before. And a lot of you I know have downloaded it and then uninstalled it because you got confused or got overwhelmed by it. In fact, I installed TSM twice before and ended up removing it both times because I didn't understand it and the UI was confusing and everything. So I'm going to give you a detailed guide on every part of the add-on and hopefully you guys will get to understand it just a little bit more. Now obviously the first thing you want to do is download the add-on. So you go to Curse, type in Trade School Master, and you download the base add-on. Now the thing is, there's a lot of different Trade School Master options, all of which can be downloaded separately. And what you really want to do is just download all of them. There are a couple which are a bit irrelevant and you don't really need, like Warehousing. I don't use TSM Warehousing. But basically all the others you want to download because you're going to be using almost all of them. Once you've downloaded all the different Trade Skill Master add-ons, you have to make an account on TSM. Unlike other add-ons which automatically work when you log into the game, TSM will work but nowhere near as well until you have the desktop application. So what you want to do is go onto tradeskillmaster.com, create a free account and download the desktop application. Basically this scans your chosen realm or realms every three or four hours to give you constant up-to-date pricing. So it never has to scan the auction house in game, which takes time. It will just do it in the background and you'll always have pretty much up-to-date prices when you mouse over any item in the game and when you try and sell anything, which is really useful. So on the website, once you've downloaded the desktop application, it will allow you to choose your realm. If you're on multiple realms, you can put up to 10 in, which I obviously do because I sell pets across servers. But yeah, put your main realm in and any others you might want to use, and it will start scanning your current realms. So now you should be all set up. Trade Skill Master application should be running in the background. You should have downloaded all the different parts of TSM, made your free account, and you're ready to go. So first of all, you want to press the Trade Skill Master icon on your mini map, and this confusing screen will pop up. Now, this is just the information part of the screen. What you really want to be concentrating on are the bits at the top. These four sections, features, options, groups, operations, accounting, crafting, destroying. I'll go over each of these in separate videos, but basically, the options is just obviously setting your options for whatever you're doing. The groups is how you group all your items so you can easily sell them. I'll cover that. Operations, they're joined to groups. Accounting basically just tells you everything you've spent, everything you've sold, everything, oh, the failed auctions. It even gives you a nice graph of your player gold. Crafting is another really useful feature which I will go through in a different time. And destroying is just disenchanting, prospecting and stuff like that. You will also notice that your mailbox has changed. Basically, it now tells you the exact price and what's sold in this main screen here. You can open all mail just with this button, so you press it, it automatically opens all. Or you can open all of different types of mail. For example, if I would press this, it would open all my sales. If I wanted to open everything that had expired, I'd press this. Anything I've cancelled, I'd press that. So it just groups them really nicely and it has a nice sending feature. And you can also do things like mailing, disenchants, your enchanter or whatever. Your crafting window, profession window will also have changed. Don't worry about that, don't freak out. I'll cover that in a separate video. The last thing you want to do is go onto TSM features, go onto macro setup and set up your scroll macro. So select up and down. I don't do modifiers, you can do one if you want. And then press create macro and bind scroll wheel. A lot of you will have zoom in and zoom out. 
macro to your scroll wheel but you're gonna to have to change that to something else because this is really really important basically if you're selling hundreds of items which you will be when you get going with TSM you can just scroll the macro and it will immediately press hundreds of times because it's just each scroll counts as a click and it basically it saves you loads of time instead of having to click post or click cancel a hundred times you just scroll your mouse wheel like five times and it will do everything for you so that's about it for the basic guide you should have installed TSM and all the modules made an account on tradeskillmaster.com downloaded the desktop application and set up your scroll wheel macro now we can start adding groups learning about crafting and all that but you're now all set up and ready to go so until next episode see ya